Chapter 4 Using Word 2016 Microsoft Word 2016 is a word processing software that allows us to type text on a computer and make changes to it. We can use various tools provided in this software to edit and format the text using different colors, pictures and styles. Uses of Word 2016 By using Word 2016, we can Type letters, stories and reports quickly and easily. Present the text beautifully and neatly using different colors, styles and effects. Add pictures to the documents, stories and poem. Remove all the errors from the document using spelling and grammar features. Make changes in the text while typing as well as after typing. Copy or move the text in a document or a new document. Save the text to use later. Print the complete document or a part of it. Starting Word 2016 Follow these steps to start Word 2016. Step 1. Click on the Start button on the taskbar. Step 2. From the Start menu, scroll down to the letter W and select Word. Step 3. Click on blank document and a new document appears. Components of Word 2016 window Look at the components of Word 2016 window. Title bar. It is present at the top of the Word 2016 window. This bar displays the name of the document and the name of the program. On the right side of the title bar, there are three control buttons, minimize, maximize and close button. Quick access toolbar. It is present on the left side of the title bar. It contains commonly used command buttons such as save, undo or redo. Ribbon. The toolbars and menus are replaced by a ribbon in Word 2016, which is made up of tabs and groups. Each tab and group has a set of commands present in the shape of tool buttons. These buttons are further divided into various groups. Tab Tabs are located below the title bar and quick access toolbar. There are nine tabs present in Word, Home, Insert, Design, Layout, References, Mailing, Review, View and Help. Each tab has a specific group of related functions and commands which are used to complete the tasks. Vertical and Horizontal Scroll Bars The vertical scroll bar is located along the right side of the screen and is used to move up and down in the document. You can click and drag the vertical scroll bar. The horizontal scroll bar is located above the status bar and is used to move left and right in the document. You will not see a horizontal scroll bar if the width of the document fits on the screen. Text Document Area There is a large area just below the ruler which is called the text area. You can type the text in this area. The blinking vertical line in the upper left corner of the text area is called the cursor or the insertion point. Status Bar it shows the details of the current document, such as, page number, number of pages, lines, words, etc. Zoom slider. The zoom slider is in the lower right corner of the status bar. It is used to enlarge and reduce the size of the window quickly and easily. Creating a new document in Word 2016. Follow these steps to create a new Word document. Step 1. Click on File tab. The Backstage view appears. Step 2. Select New option from the left pane. Step 3. 
click on the blank document option in the right pane. A blank document will appear on the screen. Now, you can type the your text in it. Entering the text. Once the new document is open, you can start typing. In Word, we do not need to press the Enter key after typing the text in a line. We can continue typing because the text automatically shifts to the next line. However, if we need to begin a new paragraph we have to press the Enter key. We use Spacebar, Enter, Delete and Backspace keys frequently while typing in Word 2016. Saving a document We can save a document after finishing the work. Follow these steps to save a document in Word 2016. Step 1. Click on the File tab. Step 2. Select Save or Save as option from the left pane. Step 3. Select this PC option from the center pane. Then click on the Browse option. Step 4. The Save as dialog box will appear. Select the location of the file. Type a name in the file name box. Step 5. Click on the Save button. The name of the saved document will appear on the title bar top of the document. A new document can also be saved by clicking on the Save icon from the Quick Access toolbar. Opening a saved document. Follow these steps to open any saved document. Step 1. Open Word 2016 and click on File tab. Step 2. Click on the Open option from the left pane. Step 3. Select this PC option from the center pane. Step 4. To open dialog box appears. Select the location where you saved your file and click on the file name. Step 5. Click on the open button. The document will appear. Exiting Word Follow these steps to exit Word. Step 1. Click on File tab. An info screen appears. Step 2. Select Close option from the left pane. If the document is not saved, Word displays a message box. Step 3. Click on Save button if you want to save the document. If you do not want to save the document, click on the Don't Save button. Word 2016 window will close.